Good evening. My name is Patricia Lujan. I am from Ulysses, Kansas, and tomorrow I will be graduating with a Bachelor of Science in Elementary Education. I once read, man can live 40 days without food, about three days without water, about eight minutes without air, but only one second without hope. I feel as if this was me when I began my experience at Newman, but they not only provided me with an education, but the staff provided me with kindness. When I began my second degree with the Western Kansas Newman program, I thought I am going to just go and do my homework just to get finished. But it was truly the opposite. As I began school, I was going through a very hard process of grieving a very close friend. Two weeks into class and I lost another family member. I was so lost and had no motivation to do anything. It felt as if all hope was lost. I remember asking if it was too late to withdraw from classes. I was over it, but little did I know that God was working through my instructors. Through their caring actions, I learned what it truly meant to be an educator. It was about giving your all at all times. It was about showing your students that despite their situation, they could get through any obstacle. These instructors pushed me to my limits. They finally were able to accomplish what I never could. That is knowing who I truly was and discovering the gift that God had given me. The way Newman describes learning is exactly what happened to me. It describes learning as being a transformation that guided by Christ, it can be a positive one. I walked out from the darkness into the light. I finally found my true calling of being an educator. If I had not found this hope at Newman, I'm not sure where I would be. I am so proud to say that I am a graduate of a Catholic university. But there is no way I could have done it without certain people. To Jessica, our director, thank you for helping me to find who I truly was after all hope had been lost. You have built this program to be amazing. To Janae and Gina, I don't know how you did it. Teaching us multiple evenings a week, you were always there to calm me down when I was having a meltdown. I will forever hold all of you as examples of the educator that I want to be. And finally, to one last person I have to thank, my sister Gloria. If you hadn't pushed me so hard this last year, I never would have finished. I hope you truly know that I will forever be grateful to you. You ladies are a great example of what this wonderful university is. And as I finish, I would like to remind you guys that God is never truly finished with our story. It's never too late to have a new start. And like Matthew Kelly once wrote, it's never too late to choose to become the best version of yourself. God wants us to be people of possibility, and people of possibility never give up. So now I commend you to go out into the world and become those people who spread hope. Congratulations on this new journey.